intergenerational cooperation, it's quite an interesting subject. And I think the most obvious thing to say would be that it's multiple generations helping each other to achieve something. The different generations can bring to the table unique characteristics. For example, those who are older will have more wisdom, more experience, while the younger often have lots of energy and optimism. Youth have a very, very special capacity that isn't really recognized in this day and age. They're able to adapt to so many situations and overcome and endure so many things. Um, me personally, for me it's not only multiple generations helping each other, but it's also for sharing of understanding. Through consultation, the truth can only be achieved when considering perspectives from all different views. And the only way that they can gain this knowledge or learn from past experiences is to learn from and cooperate with older generations. And um, I think thanks to this uh, intergenerational cooperation, we may advance in the betterment of this world that we're trying to build uh, at a much faster pace. Uh, thanks, also thanks to the wisdom that they have and the excitement of doing something that we have. Intergenerational cooperation is important because adults know how to fill the flaws of youth and youth know how to fill the flaws of adults in order to effectively achieve change. Youth have a special capacity and an incredible role in this world. But in order for youth to effectively advocate for these issues we care so much about, we need the support and the wisdom of older generations. And EBBF is providing us that opportunity. It's providing a space where youth and adults alike can come together and have meaningful discourse.